I have nothing to gain. Sorry. You didn't do anything wrong. It looked like the front of that thing was in cursive when I looked at it when you first stopped, so I was, I was looking back here. I turned over and they're like, can you do this? I'm like, no, I don't know. Oh well. to purge itself out of, is it all just out of the bottom of the tank? It's from here back, so it went down there on the bottom, so it could be. Yeah, I guarantee it just had to clear itself. You think when he lifted like that, it's going to be able to pull it back out real quick? Or? Maybe. Feel like too much gear? I don't know. It's like 73, 74 on the bottom numbers. Yeah, yeah it's got to be. It just feels like this, these boxes always just have so much more play. Play? Yeah. We can try to work on it. I can probably tighten it up some. It's weird, like, pitman slows it down. <laughs> yeah, it feels like it's, like, it's going and then it's like, like it's, I mean, it just feels a lot. I gotcha. I feel like you're too, like, too left. Late left? Yeah. Yeah, so like it gets left easy, but I feel like if we're trying to get it up more, like, I feel like one time I tried to roll in on it. That's what it, it just looks like it needs stuck to me. Like they, he just did that, but like you are went that in your group. Then I mean you went a 208, so you're like inside of a tenth. Enough. Not through the middle now. Yeah. Like that first lap I went in and it just gets down into the entry and then it like kind of blows the left rail and exit and then I'm just trying to kind of chase it up to keep it from wanting to do it more, trying to keep it down. It just gets in and then it lays down and then it wants to do that. Okay, I think I got it. Yeah, that's it. The second lap, I tried to move up higher in the one because I thought I cheated it a little bit. And then, like, went to, like, kind of turn in. And it was, like, I don't want to say it's, like, sloppy, but it was, like, right front, right over an entry. I'm, like, that's not what I wanted to do. And it came back down. It didn't kill me as much as I thought, but... Yeah, we just 
We needed to be like on the high eights been. instead of the low nines, so and we'd have been fine. I mean, half a tenth would have put a six right now. Well, I mean, I'm actually. Half a tenth would almost be fourth. Point oh one, so one hundredth better would put us eighth. Track. Can you still get to that one? Like that, that's my, my fear. Yeah, but we changed both of your shocks and both of your bars. The dumb bars, I went from a red to a white rubber and a stiffer left rear shock, and we still went, so it can't be the shock. You know what I mean?
survivable again. Literally, if, if you would have waited, like, Todd was backing him up so hard that, like, if you waited to slide back one more corner and split him, then we were gold. Because Todd and Shane were just gold. This way. Yeah. I, when you warmed up, I was like, oh. okay, we're normal. Yeah. That was the first thing I thought. I went in there and just like, oh. I wish I would have waited. I don't know why. I thought I was close enough where I could get to here and kind of maybe make him check up. And, yeah. And I didn't know how much of a shot I had if I waited another lap. But. I'm probably got a little easier. But it was, it was so good. Like, those, I, when I got by Parker, they were straight ahead. Yeah. And, like, went straight to the bumper. I, I stay in such, like, a small bubble that, like, you know what I mean? Like when I'm bad, I'm just like a little bit bad, or you know, I'm just hit it. So when I'm like fucked up like that, you know something's screwed up. Yeah. I'm just glad it is, because I was starting to think that maybe I couldn't build cars anymore. If, if we can take that in its tomorrow for qualifying, I mean, because it's a lot with the outlaws, but I mean, we're talking half the ten. Yeah. Well, I mean, just think what you had drove in the heat race and we qualified almost where we needed to be. I'm just glad I'm not going to go spend the next, like, four hours in the shop on the scales and stuff trying to figure out what. Yeah, like I said, even though we're not in a feel way better now that we're back to where it needs to be. Yeah. Well, I'm just glad we wasted a night. It's alright, up. This is one of those times when you want to send like a press release out that was like something was broken. <laughs> it yeah. wasn't us. Yeah. yeah, Darren put a bad bar in the car from the lane stroke. Yeah. Thanks, Darren. Darren broke it, literally. Yeah. Was that a bar from his crash? Yeah, I mean. Theoretically, like, the only time usually that you kill bars is when you, like, bend the tube. You know what I mean? And, like, you throw them away when you bend the tube. And, like, those just broke the arms off. So you wouldn't think it would have had any, like, torsion or anything weird on it. But maybe it broke the shock off and twisted it way around and banged the stop, you know, or something. And, and really, like, torqued it real hard. I think it would be better. I know it will. Yeah. Do it. Don't do it.
imagine the second lap would have been a lot better if we didn't get some dust. Yeah. One and two, like, I wouldn't change anything about one and two. Yeah. It's like, you can't run it up on entry to three, obviously. Like, a lot of people are dropping it down and running across. And I feel like as soon as like, I pull off the bank and you're trying to roll at it this way, like, it just still like, drops down and wants to back itself up across. Like, it's, no matter how straight I try and run it, it somehow still like drops itself down. And you know, like, that's why I try to run it a little straighter and, and across more, and it, and it did it worse the second lap. Yeah. So I don't know if, if that's just something that I did or, or it's like how much straighter I can shoot come at it. Yeah. It's like then it's like once it gets up to the top on four like it almost feels like it's still like right there. It was like, oh, yeah, it's still, I mean with the little moisture that's there there's still something to pick up or to like yeah to pull up on off. Down there, we just get hung on that piece of weight being over here. Because that piece of weight's down there right by that collector. Yeah. What was What's up? I just imagine that the rotor's not lined up. I just looked at it. It's like I, I don't even know which direction I'm pushing. Yeah, you can try to put the thing, put that other one on there. I, it just seems like as soon as I suck the pucks back in it like it, it spins free it's like the pucks just aren't pushing back for some reason and i don't know if that'd be caliper or master cylinder is this paddle coming back or is pedal coming back like the pedal's not getting not returned all the way by chance is it yeah it is if anything it feels like today it's got a little more throw but i haven't even used it like so that much so like it lands okay it just wants you like Center is worse, exit's even worse, kind of deal. Yeah. In the three, it didn't quite get to the center as good as it normally does, but it, like, once it, it's like once it gets air on the sideboards, then it just drops it and just does that all the way. Yeah. But it's like, I'm trying to keep it as straight as I can, but it still wants to kind of naturally like fall out, and then once air catches the boards, then it, it just finishes it off. Yeah. I know one of two's got a little more grid, but it's like, like one and two, like, like I said, I wouldn't change anything about one and two. But you could be tighter down there and it wouldn't hurt you? Yeah, no, I think so. Yeah. I feel like it's always stuff like this that I don't race enough, so I don't have that, like, exact how far do I go kind of note.
get the key to it, but then it's like you get on the shelf. Yeah. And then, but yeah, so same thing, like.
Vegeta and Tony Stark, it looked for all the world like Vegeta was wrapping up for the first part of the season one season. I have nothing to gain. That's true. <laughs> What'd you change it for if you just can park it? I, we, they, we had it. I, I said it was done. Everyone can't fucking hear it. I saw it. I saw it. That's what I saw it out there. I was sitting in the trailer. I pulled Dervish up trying to get a replay. And I saw it. Like, really goes one. Yeah, I thought it was done. 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 I just saw a green nose wing go once I came back. The top wing post? Yeah, the right side post was. Like the bolt was still in it, but it yanked the post out. It seemed like you're alright, just kept getting by everybody being throwing haymakers. Yeah. Yeah, it's like I run bottom one lap. Trying to get under someone, get past, and then move back up and run some laps, and then get slid, or and then cross it back over, and then yeah. This is like the deal with Sheldon and Parker. Like, we would have been free of that group, and we could have. Yeah, I think once like once we get surrounded, like if we went past, like all those guys were sliding each other, Spencer and Jack. And yeah, you just kept getting the shit into the yeah the war. Like early on, the first couple laps on the bottom was like good. Like once I got off the top to the bottom, yeah. I was like, I'm on the bottom. And then I don't know if someone got chopped or someone drove on the side of someone I saw McFadden like and someone else like spin this way and they were washing up the track. And then I seen Jack like smoke the fence. Yeah. Like, I think he did it by himself, but I think he was trying to gas to get around him and then hit the fence himself. Yeah. And then. It was so dusty, like I didn't, I didn't know where he was at. Like I didn't know if he was flipping this way or this way, so I just checked up. And then like he like appeared out of nowhere and like got him in the, he got me in the right front and spun me around and I think that Giovanni guy, whatever. Yeah, he plowed into everybody. Yeah. As dumb as it sounds, like. like I, I, I feel like if I would've knew where Jack was, I, I could've got around him because I think he ended up flipping down a little bit. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. You almost could have like just flat sided to the wall and yeah. squeezed through. I, I think if you were like, but because you were bent and trying to stop. Yeah. yeah. When he rooster tail, like then I, like at that point I just didn't know where he was. Yeah. Like if he probably would have like checked up and rolled around him and not rooster tail, I probably could have got around him. But yeah. He kicked up so much dirt, I didn't even know where he was at. But. You almost probably could have kept around the bottom at the beginning. Yeah, like. Carried, like, got a huge run off the top and was going around guys and like drive my. It's your cue. I gotta get up. But yeah, on that restart I ran the top and like had a good run. Then we ran like two laps and I, all of a sudden like Donnie appeared out of the dust and he was four cars ahead of me and like just run just on the bottom of the restart. Yeah. Sorry. You didn't do the wrong. It just like the time we finally. Kind of it looked like the front of that thing was in cursive when I looked at it when you first stopped. So I was, I was looking back here. Turned over and they're like, "Can you do this?" I'm like, "No, <laughs> I don't know." Oh well. 